Hello Pisces and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of February 6th and this is a quick and general reading. I want to mention that the yearly readings, the 2023 readings, last chance to book in for those will be February 9th. It's a Thursday. That will be the last chance to get those. Um, I, I also did post the uh, yearly readings for 2023 for each sign. You can find them on my YouTube channel. And I did post the monthly February readings too, so you can find those there too. All right, Pisces, February 6th. Let's take a look here. Pisces, it's a little bit of a week where we're looking at um, changes. You've got the number five is coming in really strong. I am seeing here a few energies for you. Um, a lot of um, energies here, but home, there is some kind of either movement or adjustment. So I am seeing that kind of energy, but it's going to bring you a victory. Okay. Um, new people, um, new passion, new um, experiences. So I'm seeing that kind of energy, very passionate energy is showing up here too. And I do see there leads to some kind of a victory is what I'm seeing here. Okay. Um, this is going out of focus. Okay. <laughs> um, there is a sense of you're completing something. Something is going to be successful. Can be connected to the home or work. Um, fulfillment. For some of you, these are plans to travel. You may be excited. Um it's some kind of a celebration. So I see that and commencing a definitely a new um, cycle. So victory is definitely showing up there. I like that. Uh, yeah. All right. You know, this is a week overall that you will get what you want. Okay. So I'm seeing that this is a new financial beginning too. I do see this is us all a lot of growth, um, abundance around you, very nurturing energy. I do see some of you could be dealing with mother energy, your mother these are positive changes at home, all right? So I do see this, your, uh, it's growth, it's evolution, beautiful, prosperity, abundance is around you, so it's surrounding you as well. For some of you, this is a um, mother taking care of you or someone nurturing you too, or has very, um, I want to say, kind of pampers you somehow as well. Maybe you don't even know about it. There's someone out there who may be even just making affirmations for you. That's so another way I'm looking at that, Okay. I do see that uh, wisdom and um, it's a learning experience. You're on the right path here too. Maybe you want to be more to yourself, but something is going to be made clear to you. This is a light bulb moment, an epiphany, a dawning of a new day, beautiful energy here, okay? Um, maybe you thought that people didn't recognize you, didn't... Um, you felt left out. I don't know, but I see you being recognized here. It's a victory, more self-confidence. Uh, people want to be around you, new friendships. I am seeing that kind of energy, so that's looking good. I am seeing here, too, that um, money could be on the mind here or worries, all right? It's like you're keeping some things to yourself more. You're holding on to energy a little bit too tightly, though, too, okay? Okay. Now, I do see that there is a cancer energy here, too. Could be dealing with a cancer. I see water sign energies. Cancer and Scorpio as well may come into play this week. Now, there is an energy here that you feel disappointments um, or pessimism. Pessimism. <laughs> um, this is like money worries or something is showing up there as well. But I feel it's more um, worries than it is um, an actual thing to be concerned about. So I do feel that energy. Um, I do see some changes, some challenges before you. So that's showing up. It's, um, there's some comp a competition when it comes to love. If you're single, there's, um, people fighting over you or there is that whether you re realize it or not. So I do see that energy too. There is some conflicts and some challenges ahead to stay out of drama. All right. So I do feel that energy. This is a time of taking care of yourself, making practical decisions. You've got financial responsibilities to take care of at home. I am seeing that um, as well. So that's showing up, but it looks good here. You have a very nurturing um, energy coming through too. Nice. Um, I am seeing here some of you dealing with mother, okay? 
Uh, this is a lot of um, beautiful energy, though. This is a good week for contracts and agreements, and love is definitely showing up. This could be love with a Scorpio or a water sign energy or someone who exhibits those energies. You have more courage than what you think. Um, your passions um, are very powerful this week, too. Uh, this is subtle power that you have, too. You're very pers persuasive, and you have inner strength and definitely needing to focus. So I'm seeing that, too. This is a beautiful week of new beginnings with home and abundance all around you. A lot of thoughts of the future and a lot of uh, drawing in energy to you, too. you got a lot of options and choices before you. I do feel that come maybe end of March to April, you have a powerful new beginning and some kind of abundance is coming your way. This is power and strength that you have, and you have more control than what you think. Uh, there is going to be some significant celebration as well, so I'm seeing that. Now, a little bit of a downside here, and this, if it doesn't apply to you, it applies to someone else, but I've seen this in a few readings, so... Um, this is envy or jealousy around you. It's like you maybe see other people succeed and you're like, well, I work just as hard or whatever it is. Let go of that because, um, that energy is not good. Okay. Um, I always say if they can have it, so can you. So I do see that surrounds you a little, um, there's also letting go of some kind of a guilt. I don't know. Uh, forgive yourself for what you think you've done or not done and trust, um, in yourself. Okay. Learn and grow from past mistakes, whatever it is. Don't hold on to things, all right? So stop berating yourself. Stop beating yourself up. Letting go of guilt is going to be important. I'm seeing that kind of energy. Um, also, it is a strong week, strong week of taking care of your body, taking care of your diet. So this is like either starting a gym or a routine program or starting to purge, detox. I do see that energy. Uh, decluttering is very important. You'll feel much better and more focused if you take the time to clear away the clutter from your living space, workspace, whatever. Okay. It's a good time. I mean, I do this all the time. I go through things periodic, um, almost monthly. Anything you don't need, donate it. Okay. Goodwill, wherever, whatever your choice is, donate it. Um, because what you don't need can really help others too. So decluttering is very important. Um, some people may need your items. You know how they say what your junk is. It could be somebody else's uh, treasure. So be sure to keep your schedule uncluttered as well. Prioritize this week and declutter. Okay. So it is a strong week to take care of the body, let go of some kind of guilt. And also decluttering is so important and some kind of jealousy surrounds you as well. So it's like, it's important to, if they can have it, so can you, you know, that kind of energy, okay? But you get what you want this week. There's a victory too, okay? All right, uh, Pisces, that is your reading for the week of um, February 6th. I hope you have a fabulous week and I'll talk to you next week. Bye for now.